Alright, we're gonna fix the thing that I experienced last time on uh, Debian. Um, let me show you what I was talking about though. Alright, so if you want to remove, um, what is it, sudo apt git remove Braserio. The problem is not removing it really, is, is the problem is that, um, uh, you know, you're gonna be left with all these packages here that's going to be unresolved or they call it a broken state uh, and, and if you do a auto um, remove or something uh, then it's going to remove all the shit that you need so if I do an update you can see that all these packages are um, it says no longer um, required although you still you know want to use it because these are like system tools and it's part of a, a meta package so if you ever do a auto, I mean uh, app get uh, auto remove, then it's gonna remove all this thing that you need. Okay. Um, so to to resolve this is to to uh, manually mark it as not auto remove. And to do that, we're gonna use this program that's already in your system. It's called App Mark, and uh, that's what we're gonna be using. Okay. So we're gonna go sudo apt mark uh, unmark auto so this is gonna mark it to not auto remove okay so what you have to do is now is just copy uh, the packages in here okay so I'm giving an example just the first line okay so we do this uh, and we do an update again it's not gonna ask us for uh, you know to remove uh, seahorse or empathy or whatever that we just uh, paste in here. So if I run this, right now, if I do with the update, you won't see um, C Seahorse or M50 in there anymore. Right, it got rid of uh, the ones that we wanted. So you keep doing this for the rest of them. Uh, what is it? Let me do another one here, so you can understand. So sudo app mark unmark auto and um, there you go now if you do update again um, these packages here will not show up on here anymore uh, and that means it's good for you okay so I was at the net tools and gnome screenshot and um, gconf editor alright so you see you reduce uh, your um, was that your broken packages by setting it to uh, manual install I guess anyways that's uh, app mark um, if you ever experience something like this uh, where your package is in a broken state uh, you use app mark uh, if you want to get more help on it just type in app mark dash h or what up maybe man app mark and it'll probably give you some more details here okay so that's how you fix that problem as far as the other one I have I don't know how to figure that out yet but when I do, I'll tell you about it. Anyways, app mark, uh, unmark auto, or there's another option is to uh, mark auto if you want to automatically, uh, you know, remove it. Uh, so that's it, though.